The Gates Megatron doing what he does. Seven catches, 164 receiving yards. The game's first two touchdowns to spot the Lions a 14-0 lead. And they held on for the convincing win over the Giants. And talent, respecting talent, LeBron tweeting. One of his tweets had a hashtag, my favorite player in the world. Kevin Durant says, you know you're sick at what you do when we call you Megatron. So both NBA stars respecting him. We all know he's great. But could you see him winning the MVP? No, I cannot. No Wide way. receiver's never done it. Because to win the MVP, I would have to rely on Matthew Stafford having a career year as well in getting you the football. And I'm not sure I can rely on him to be consistent enough to do it. I know Matthew Stafford is gifted. I know he can fling that football. I know Megatron had over 1,400 receiving yards last year. But so did A.J. Green. You know, I mean, you know, you look at the Antonio Browns of the world in Pittsburgh, they can ball a little bit. You look at the Marius Thomas, he also had over 1,400 receiving yards, and he's got Peyton Manning throwing him the football instead of Matthew Stafford. So I think when you consider it that way, I think you're going to look to the quarterback. If, if, if Megatron has a breakout year, it'll be because Stafford is having a breakout year. And if they have to give it to one of the two, it's going to be the quarterback. That's why. It's now, not Stafford that. was, I'm going back three years ago when he had the 45 right. touchdowns and right. they got to the first round of the playoffs at New Orleans right. and got blown out. I'm not going to say that Megatron's skills and, and, and numbers won't deserve it. Yeah. But it'll be because Stafford got him the ball, and that means Stafford would get it. So I don't see it happening. I'm going to pay this man the ultimate respect and Big give time. him, I'm going to give him an outside shot at winning MVP. He was the MVP of that game last night. Yes, he was. I think you would have to agree. No question. But the Giants factored in because they did choose to mostly single cover him with DRC, just mm -hmm. as Dallas, as we talked about earlier, tried Brandon Carr, and it cost him 329 yards. So he plays the position in which you can try to take Megatron out of the game completely with double or triple coverage. On the other hand, Stafford has so much confidence in him that I remember a game, I'm going back again three years ago in Dallas. Remember the big comeback that Detroit had in the second half in Dallas? And Stafford was just throwing it up into double coverage because he knew Megatron could just rise up over anybody and snatch it out of the air. And that, in, in that regard, he, Calvin isn't as fast as Randy Moss was, but I think he's more athletic and has better hands going up. Like he can, he can snatch jump Agreed. balls better. Agreed. He's the big time. He's big time. He's in a class all by himself. By himself. Receiver. Yeah. Marius Thomas, A.J. Green, Antonio Brown, and these boys, they're big time as well. But they ain't Megatron. They're not on his level. Okay. So the, the, the point becomes, if, if people are triple covering by mid-year Calvin Johnson, then what happens with Golden Tate? Does he start catching eight or ten balls? What, what happens to Fourier? Well, six what, what, last night. Ebron, you know, the, these other the tight ends, do they start catching a, a bunch of yes. balls? Does he start flipping balls to Reggie Bush, who, who's going to get Why yards not? after catch? But, but I still say, I think Detroit is going to have a big year. I think the offense is going to have an even bigger year. And I think that Megatron is virtually unstoppable, that he's still, he, even his bad games will look pretty good. And when you it's, see, it's one of the things that amazes me, Skip, you'll need a first down from him and everything. Yeah. You know teams, whether it's in their cover two or whatever the case may be, it doesn't matter. Somehow, some way, he just seems like he gets open with easy. He's such a big target. Yeah. There's little to nothing you could do with him. 6'5", yeah. 240.